The nuclear power plant in Van Buren County has taken its reactor offline, shutting down early, now earlier than the company had expected. News A's Kyle Mitchell here now with what could be next for the site. Kyle? Soon, Brian, the Palisades nuclear power plant was scheduled to close by the end of May, but the company says it moved up the timetable as a precaution. After more than 50 years, the Palisades nuclear power plant along the shores of Lake Michigan is no longer producing electricity. There's no more risk of reactor core meltdowns. As soon as the nuclear fuel comes out of the core, there will be no more generation of high-level radioactive waste. But so many risks remain. You've got 50-plus years of high-level radioactive waste stored out there. Kevin Camps with Beyond Nuclear applauds the closure, but says it should have happened years ago. Palisades is one of, was one of the most dangerous atomic reactors in the country. The group has voiced concerns about equipment at the plant, which began commercial operation in 1971. Just a short list of Palisades' major problems would include the most brittle reactor pressure vessel in the country, steam generators that have needed replacement for the second time in the plant's history, and a degraded lid that needed to be replaced 15 years ago. The company that owns the plant, Energy, says an issue with the performance of a control rod drive seal is why the plant closed earlier than originally scheduled. Energy also says the 800 megawatt facility has been operating safely for more than 50 years. So we're going to need a lot of reliable energy, and uh, nuclear is consistent. The Michigan Conservative Energy Forum says nuclear can be safe and produce electricity without carbon emissions at the site. The group supports Governor Gretchen Whitmer's plan to keep the plant open. It's an extremely long shot now. There's no question about that. Um, and if in the long term we can't bring Palisades back online, we should look at that location as an opportunity to bring new generation um, small modular reactors in onto that site. Holtec International is buying the plant and says it can decommission the facility by 2041.